Hi everyone, welcome back. In this video, we will talk about the ellipses. We are continuing on this list, and these are the. This is the ellipse we will talk about, and here they clearly explain the geometrical explanation. Uh, if someone interested, they can check also here. But I will directly explain why on the code part. Let's pass on this part, and here. Uh, this ellipse function has two overload function. There are two types of this. And first one is uh, just taking the image which is in we created in here, matrix form. And here is the point, center point of the ellipse which we want to create. And uh, here sizes, angles. Let's talk about the why on the explanation in here. For example, uh, the width and i also want to show this part let's make like this okay first one uh, the point uh, center point is here 500 to 500 and here is the, our image and yeah this size for example size width and height is means for example width uh, width of this uh, if you calculate from center to here or center to here this is the width one and height is the this one and after this angle comes and this angle means the rotation rotation degree of this ellipse for example if you change if you make it like this the from this point to this point how many the rotation accordingly and also you can check here they are showing this angle what does it mean you can also check in that part start angle is uh, which part you are starting to draw your ellipse if you make it zero it start from zero for example this is the starting point and this is the ending point and if you change ending point and it's also drawing like this so you can also control uh, which how many which part of ellipse you want to draw if you want to fully draw you can simply zero to 360 degree from start angle to end angle and it's done let's pass on this is simply like that and the second overloaded function of ellipse also do the same one just the only difference in here uh, we done this uh, rotated rectangle is uses what's rotated rectangle we will talk about this later but just to simply uh, any drawing rectangle the ellipse is fitted to inside this rectangle uh, for example if you say the center and the size which width and height the angle also same if you do like this it will give us a rectangle simply uh, in this kind of the center here 444 to 444 and the size is uh, 100 width 200 height and rotation is zero angle is zero and done one more thing we should talk today about ellipse is ellipse to poly there are two again like overloaded function both and let's talk about just this one is enough I think uh, what it does actually difference than the ellipse let's talk it does not directly draw any ellipse this is the only difference and what it does actually it's giving us uh, an output vector in here you can see vector points what does these points means for example if I just use this function this is center this is size width and height these are same parameters which this one uh, so i will not talk about them again these are angles starting ending angle whatever and this is the output vector which we assign to uh, our points to this vector so if we uh, to just to see we are we should draw this so i'm checking all these vector inside elements and i'm making them yellow color and to just to see let's see the result uh, uh, yeah lastly we were trying to run this one but uh, there is a problem in here i also meet so don't do this there are some many kind of errors just make this uh, don't make this zero because this is the accuracy one this delta so let's try like this and sorry let's try this one okay what does it mean actually this is uh, just if you make this one for example the accuracy is one so they are the points is very close to each other but if you make this if let's say 20 for example 
so the approximated uh, points are as you can see is the distance to each other so it's just giving you the points the which is approximating to an ellipse any ellipse so then it's not drawing but it's giving you a vector just difference of this one that and it's not drawing directly also it's just assigning to a vector and here what else i want to talk also these are not integer in reality just to show in create track bar it's just on taking integer that's why i make integers normal this angle also degree and double should be double but just to show in this part i made it integer i think we are done with ellipse today uh, see you in the next videos to okay see you